How's it going, everybody? And welcome back to Little Misfortune. Uh, if you remember last episode, quick recap, as we normally do here, a lot of misfortune. That's I mean, you gotta watch it to find out. It's a lot of bad stuff, basically. So we're going to continue Little Misfortune today. Oh, here we are, straight back into it, like instantly. Um, this is where we saw Benjamin. I remembered his name. So oop, there's his brush. I could take the brush and I can finish the circle for him. How kind am I? Why did it zoom out to here? I sure hope nothing bad happens. <laughs> well that was pleasant. So these little things are safe spaces. Got it. Alright. Need to know. Crows. The crows are back. Oh, and the crows are gone. Well, what of a miss? There's still three. Four. Three, two, one. There was one now. Can I read that sign? That seems important. Oh, well. What's this? Oh, is this the magical cave? Looks it real magic. Oh. magical. <laughs> we had Just two different... Until you go inside. <laughs> Ooh. Well, I like the sound of that. Very interesting I indeed. Question. Yep. What does this sign mean? Now we point out the sign. I don't know. Sparkle? Sparkles. Sparkles. Oh, cool. So... You're ready. Sparkles. Ooh. Stay in the forest or into the cave. I feel like if we stay in the forest, we're not going to do anything. So, might as well go in. Uh, Doesn't I seem like I really have a choice, huh? Magic cave. Magic cave. I forgot I could sparkle stuff. Well, I can only sparkle the things that sparkle. But. <gasps> this cave is huge. It's a neat weapon. <laughs> well, I could do, I could that, do too. that too. I won't, I won't but I could. I could. I could. She's so silly. It was me. You're a real comedian, Scorchio. Thank you. Just the funniest around. All right. Magical cave. Big stick. Two little sticks. Could have been one big stick for all I know. Hello. Who was that? What? Did I miss something? Oh, you missed something very important. A little guy. How could you miss the little guy? What is that? Okay. Bump into this? this? A hamster party? <laughs> magical hamster party. Oh yeah, real magical. Love parties. Is this a lound? <laughs> can we go inside? I don't Are, know. Can we? Go find out. Probably not. I would highly advise again. Who is this guy? Who's this narrator guy? Mr. Voice, where are you taking me? Nope. Whoa, hamster fight. A hamster are mugging. To do something about it? End the violence between the hamsters. I might... Yeah, I'm gonna end the violence. I'm gonna end the hamster violence. Don't fight, you adorable thing. You have to kiss and make up. <laughs> no hamster violence in my hamster neighborhood. Oh, please, sweetie, don't go. Oh. Drop something. Oh, what's that? Well, they're gone. What's this? What's this strange bag of. Oh, no. Maybe I should try one so I can keep my breath fresh. Maybe don't. Is it going to give me the option to be like, try one? Yes or no? No. Wow. It did not give me the option. Really nice. <laughs> oh, dear God. Nope. Nope. All right. Fantastic. Off to a great start. Oh. This is a change of pace. Very nice and upbeat. <gasps> it's the dog. It's a, little, it's a little dog that we definitely didn't kill earlier. It wasn't my fault. Oh, this is... Yeah, this is... Okay. There go the rainbows. <laughs> no, we've lost it. This is it. It's... <laughs> this is perfectly normal. Oh, oh no. That's not perfectly normal. I take it back. The horrors of... The horrors beyond human comprehension have come to take form. Now what? Now what happened? Oh, and she's gone. She's out. Oh, that's gross. What? Are you all right, Miss Fortune? I'm okay. At least now we know, and so now we know to never do that again. Live nude, <laughs> live nude hamsters. Is this what goes on in magical caves? Is this? I can go in? Probably not. Excuse me. How about little lady get inside? No, I'm 
Not Ooh, not a VIP. Can you believe this guy, Mr. Wolf? How yeah, could he? Find another way Unbelievable that he would he would say such a thing. We have to find another way in? It's Fantastic. Really cute because our kill and me with our cute mask. <laughs> so cute. Is this where that one hamster drove to? Oh. Look at them. With our Designated tiny smoking area? And their tiny clothing. This is too cute for me. She's so pure. Those two hamsters are doing stuff, and that's none of my business what they're doing. What they get up to is what they get up to. What's this? Export. Oh, Check that lady out. an old lady hamster. Oh no, I think I recognize her. She's the owner of the club. <gasps> well, She's the club's yes. owner. Looks like she was robbed. Oh, I bet it was that hamster oh my with God. the black mask. Yes, you're right. Looks like you helped the criminals. Oh. oh does that mean I'm a criminal too? Of course it does. Oh, oh <laughs> well, that's. Please don't kill me. Your secret is safe with me. Thank you, Mr. Thank Voice. You. you know that makes me feel a little better, but I still feel bad. All right, what can I do? Can I get the criminal back? Excuse me, do you need assistance? No. Okay. Hey, Miss Fortune, we need to find a way out now. The eternal happiness is still out there. That was it. Oh, I need to find a way out. Well, there's a button here, and I like buttons. I like pushing buttons. Let's find out. Love me a good ladder. Oh, that was it. There was nothing else to explore. That's it. So the criminal's gone, then. Well, isn't that unfortunate? I let him out, and there's nothing I can do. Oh, well. Uh, note to self. Lesson learned. Don't inter intervene on hamster violence. Let a hamster get stabbed. You know, that's... <laughs> don't, don't do that. Don't stab your hamsters. Climb the ladder. There's not much else I could do. I assume. Hold on. Can I find the hamster? Oh. Oh. It looks like the entry is blocked. Yeah, I can see that. No what? Hmm. There must be another way out. Let's look for it. Okay. So the answer was to not do that. Maybe if I'd done that first, do you think the hamster would have escaped? Oh well, it doesn't matter. But bye now. You have fun at your little hamster club. Your lewd hamsters. Whatever that means. You have fun. None of my business. I've done everything here, I think. Seems like it. I don't... <laughs> There's a lot of choices. I'm sure I missed something, but... It, uh, no, you know what? I definitely missed something. Stop. I'm gonna keep going. Squirrel speed. Squirrel speed. Whoa. Hamster bad. This looks just like a movie I saw on TV. Breaking yeah, hamster. Better call ham. Sir. But how? You see that fire alarm over there? We need to activate it. Oh. Yeah, but how? With a slingshot. What slingshot? This slingshot. <laughs> it's gonna end up like the ball situation. Okay. You know the ma situation? It's like that but the ball oh, situation. Look, the dog. Rest in peace, homie. That's really clever, Miss Fortune. <gasps> Mini game time. Oh, thank you. Now we slay. Oh, Aim with up, down, W, S, and shoot with space. How do I do that? How do I know where I'm aiming? Oh, there we go. Oh, okay. Shoot as hard as possible. Oopsie. Nope, don't. Shoot as hard as possible. Upwards. A little, a little bit lower. Harder. A little bit softer. Too soft. That was too soft again. <laughs> hit. hit nope, that's a lady. Um, that was too soft again. Oh, sorry. So too soft, too hard. Too hard. What? What am I doing wrong? Nothing. I was doing nothing wrong. Sniper. 
Yeah, I play Fortnite. How could you tell? We did it. <laughs> well done, it's very obvious. <laughs> um, easy as pie. Can I take some squirrel speed? Squirrel speed? Hmm. Fun sir. I love the way she says it. It's very funny. Gas. Gas, gas. <laughs> oh. I don't know science. I don't think you know. Science is good. <laughs> yeah, it could be. No, it can't be. Money. Oh. It's not a bad lesson from Mr. Voice. Again, he's just kind of teaching me stuff. Climb the ladder. Uh, stay in the sewer. Again, it's making me think like I've. I, I'm sure I found everything. I'm, I feel like I'm speeding through this game, though. Again, still don't know. Missing. Train. You, on the other side of the no, you're addressing me again? Hi, what's up? I know it must be hard not knowing much about our little lady's future. It's a little bit. Misfortune rarely dies. No, I'm wondering. So, how will she die? Still when wondering. Will the evil fox kill her? The fox is going to kill her? The eternal happiness. Maybe. I personally hope she does. <clears throat> Act normal. She's coming. All right, all right. Fix up my tart. <clears throat> wow, that was magical. Oh, Miss Fortune, you made it! Congratulations. Oh, Thank wonderful. You. Where are we? We're one step <gasps> closer to the grand. We're getting closer to the grand prize of eternal, eternal happiness. happiness. Why? Because I'm not Yippee. allowed to be outside oh. this lake, you know. Don't worry. It's not far from here. Good. <laughs> fantastic. This is fantastic. Alright, there's nothing over there. It would have let me. Look, missing. A missing kid. Hello. Missing. Call 112. I don't like this. Maybe I should go back home. Bye. <laughs> oh, who is that guy? I can protect you. Oh. Yes. How so? Alright, then. I wouldn't trust him so blindly, but... If you think he can, I'll believe you. Hi, that's the missing girl. There goes the missing girl. All right then. Uh, do the people have masks? Phantasmagoria. That. <laughs> yeah, no swearing. We're a family-friendly channel here. I. A uni cycle. Is that? Oh hi. Is that just a wheel? <laughs> that didn't click in my brain. Phantasmagoria, the horror fair. Phantasmagoria is coming to Oberville? That's so awesome. Maybe we could find <gasps> We could go to Phantasmagoria, maybe? Right. Don't play with my feelings now. Let's focus on finding the eternal happiness first. Then we'll see. I want to go to Phantasmagoria. Right. I can't wait. <laughs> Yippee. Phantasmagoria, the world needs a plan. <laughs> At Kill Monday Games. That's him. You know, if you ever want to hang out for something, I'm available. Don't engage with that wild fox. I told you, foxes are dangerous. I don't believe you. Oh, we got nicknames now. Oh, he's running. Let that wild beast run off. I don't beast want is a strong word. Happening to you. Oh Mystery my. beast, on the other hand. And Slugstavla. I'm sure I read that horribly wrong. You children, hide your... Uh... Sihidr... What's that one say? Hide your child, Ren. And that one, he didn't get to finish putting up. Oh, ah, this is stuff. that's the poster from the woods Absolutely of the, the of the, what did it say? It's so personal. Be aware. That's what it said. So He's an artist. That looks like a child has drawn it. What did you just say? Oh, I didn't <laughs> mean it like that. Huh. Hey, quit being so judgmental, focus man. On finding the prize. I'm focused. Can't I just have a little art break? Man. Sometimes I just want to look at some art. Orchid's Park Kiosk. Yes. Okay. 
Oh. Love a good park. Last time we went to the park. Whoa! <laughs> <laughs> Whoa, family friendly. Family friend? Let's keep it family friendly, Kai. I don't care. That was really funny. That's a good question. That's a good. We should have asked that first before we left the house. There goes another dead crow. Sounds nice. You know, I want to win this prize for my mommy. I wish I could give her that's some nice. happiness. My sparkle Jesus. doesn't work with her. Oh, that's really sweet. Thank it really is. Another dead crow. To try my sparkle. Another missing child poster. It's the same one. <laughs> Don't be silly. Sparkle. Happiness to Mr. Boy. Oh, well. Thank you. Anyway, let's go find She's just so nice to everyone and anyone. Yes. Oh, another dead crow. You know, a flock of crows is called, um, isn't it called like a death or something? A death of crows? No, that doesn't sound right. A murder. It's called a murder of crows. I remembered. It says, don't feed the bird. No. Okay. But I love feeding crows. Nice murder of crows. And a bench. I can't read much on the letter written on the bench. <laughs> Sweet poem. It's alive and it's eating from you. Sign M. Mm. Who's N? What do you think? <clears throat> uh, Miss Fortune, do you really need to read those? Poems? Can we not take a break? Yes, I do, actually. I'll have you know. Yeah. Listen to <laughs> this one. I hanging too low. <laughs> no stick I'm not sure. Where are they hanging from? Oh, exactly. A drawing of a cat. Come on, Miss Fortune. Let's Let me go. have some oh, fun, yes. man. Mr. Voice does not know how to have fun. I hope you can hear this. Because, oh. Look at the seagull. It looks like Kevin's dad. Who's Kevin? He used to sit on the sun box next to school. He didn't have any clothes on, and the police oh. officer beat him with a stick. That's fascinating. Remember <gasps> the fish. Rodrigo. You mean Rodrigo, my fish friend forever? F F F. Give it to the seagull. No. Oh. I'm sure it would appreciate some company. Oh. Mm, I guess that maybe. That yeah. Be a first Everyone needs a friend. Do, I guess. Yeah. Let's give up. Let's give up Rodrigo to this poor old seagull. Okay. Well, I that you could have been a little nicer with it. That was very kind of you. Thank mm -hmm. you. Oh, well. What? Oh no! Rodrigo is dead now. That's of unfortunate. Course. Seagulls love eating fish. We didn't I knew that. I just feel like. Well, now you know, isn't it? <laughs> See, he's just teaching me lessons. Yeah. Stupid lessons. I don't need this. Can I take the? Can I take the fish bones? I'll bury him later. Hell yeah. We'll give Rodrigo a proper funeral. Unlike half the murder of crows that have died right in front of us and behind us. Yeah. Oh, uh, duh. See, now he wants to have fun. What is, like... You read one poem about balls and he doesn't want to have fun, but... Riding a horse in the park is fun, right? Is he going to vomit again? Okay, or not. That was... Far worse than I. Uh, well, at least you didn't vomit. That was unfortunate. Are you all right? Yeah. I'm okay. Are you worried because I'm such a little lady? Of course. You are really tiny, and you could break. I broke my arm once. Oh. So you know what I mean. Mm -hmm. I thought she was just gonna vomit again. So that was like slightly better than I. Well. No. You know I don't know how much more she could vomit. What is this guy? Go, Who is this guy? To get involved with ducks. <laughs> What's wrong with ducks? <laughs> this guy's got a. And look, he's carrying a boombox. This could be my opportunity to finally dance for real. Would you like to show me some of your dance moves? Ah, uh, yeah. Let's show off our dance skills. Let's have a little bit of a dance battle. We talk about the fact that he just like has a problem with every animal. Oh, that is secondhand smoke right there. That is secondhand smoker's lung. It's okay. It's okay. <laughs> that was unfortunate. Yep. What are you talking about? That 
was normal. Oh, normal? If you <laughs> say so. Shouldn't be, but... Hey. Enough dancing. Uh, you have fun, uh, Mr. D. I don't know who that is, but, you know, he's just kind of got a big... D I guess it stands for Doc. Like <gasps> yes. It's like God, I love having fun in the park. See, and now... I don't understand why he doesn't want to have fun. He has a problem with every animal. Wee. Wait, go stop. Okay, all right, too fast. That es that elevated escalated way too. <laughs> oh no, misfortune. As again, she didn't vomit this time, which is surprising because she likes to do that a lot. Oh, when the trees are nice, she's gonna read it, isn't when she? The trees are nice, when the wind is cold, <laughs> she... <laughs> when the smell of rotten apple smashes against the stone. Interesting. Mm, apple pie. Not what you would probably get out of that, but. Nothing. Hehehe, <laughs> gatekeep, gatekeep the hey dolls. Oh, hello. Why did she like stand there and wait? Like that was strange. Benjamin, don't you think? Yeah. I think it's gone. Hi, your ch Hey. It should be erased with fire. Really? I see great potential he had, it, here. He's obviously very artistic. He's having fun, this guy. Let's keep playing my game. The he... prize is closer than you think. And he's really? egotistical. All right. He's a nar he's a narcissist. Let's keep playing my game. Nobody's allowed to have fun but me. I guess if she's having the fun. Last challenge awaits at the pet cemetery. Oh. A pet cemetery? That sounds like the best place <laughs> in the game. Exactly. My is it? Is I'm it? Glad you feel the same way. I, I don't think I could say the same. Really don't. When I go best place to end a game, um, the pet so, cemetery. I was thinking while we're walking. All right. Mind if I ask you a couple of questions? Ooh, questionnaire. I'm pretty I love good at surveys. answering questions. Great. Just answer as honestly as you can. So you're sure. Bye. First question, have you ever stolen anything? Okay. Um So are we answering this as me or as her? I don't actually think I've ever stolen I maybe stole my friend's sweet army knife once. Oh, that I is so bad. I better oh. yard and never told him. Okay. Oh, I'm so sorry. Smells like teen spirit. <laughs> sorry. Second question second question are you happy right now oh she seems happy she seems to be having a ball me personally <laughs> yes i mean nothing bad is happening right now that makes me happy well then the last question i'm answering these as her by the way oh hmm me personally i wouldn't <laughs> She hasn't left me. That's real. For your honesty. It's a good way to think about it. Look, we arrived at the pet cemetery. I want her to be happy, alright? Let me just You know, if one of us has to be happy, it should be her. Oh, now there's a second missing child. Interesting. Very interesting indeed. Can I view it? Yes. Okay. That one's got a hat. This one we saw earlier. So maybe now we'll see the other one. Ready to find the prize of eternal maybe happiness. Maybe not. Yes, what is it? I have hidden it in one of the graves. Great, I get to go I grave digging. Grave? I get to go Which grave one? robbery. I'll give you grave a hint. Robbery? It's where the goldfish is buried. Goldfish the is goldfish. buried. All right. Must I dig with my tiny hands? Great question. Take forever. No Good question. Use the shovel. What shovel? shovel? This shovel. You just always why? Okay, that one's not even like. Ah, mm, that shovel. Okay. See, that one was just suspicious because all the rest of them kind of like flew from like the right or the left of the screen, whereas that one just kind of like came up from the depths of hell. So that was a bit strange. This one said, Denise died surrounded by her <laughs> <once>. <laughs> oh. In a fight. oh no. There's actual nope. I don't think this one's a fish. If I, I mean, if I had to guess, nah. probably not a goldfish. Uh, if I had to take a guess. Okay, let's see. Little Lulu, the first bug, <laughs> strangle a man. <laughs> <laughs> no, 
No, prob if I again, probably not a goldfish, but that's kind of funny. That's the first pug to ever. This is the fish. Is that like a, it's like an official title. Little Lulu, first pug to ever strangle man. Um. Hmm. Stephanie Quinn. Oh. Ooh. Of the erotic novel Confessions of a Cat. Hmm. Erotic novel. <laughs> crazy. <laughs> Probably not something I would I would personally want. Nah, Unless it was like a best so. Yep. Okay. Yep. That the cat wrote that novel. That makes sense. Paul dies doing what he loves. It's simple. Yikes! Forever. See, that one could be a goldfish. I just I mean I'll keep looking uh, just in case. Nah, I don't think so. We'll keep looking. What's this one? Uh, let's see. Who here the magpie? Never saw <laughs> window coming. Ha. I don't Dude. Get it. I don't yep, alright. This is not a fish. Nah, I don't think That's, so. Never saw look. that window coming is insane. Like what what look, happened? This, grid is <gasps> this is where we could bury Rodrigo. Barry Rodrigo. I think I'll bury Rodrigo here. He deserves it. He was a best friend. Any last words? Rodrigo smells like a fish. I like that in a fish. He was nice. I hope he likes me. Bye, Rodrigo. What? Such a way with words, really. All right, bury him. Was beautiful. It was. It was. Barry Rodrigo. That's it. Mr. Bubbles. Mr. Bubbles. Mm. That's all I get? Alright. I'm gonna believe this is a fish, I guess. I should have checked if there were more. Congratulations. Oh, that was it. You found the prize. I had a hunch. Really? Yes. Let's go. You the little box. Open it. Oh, okay. Exciting. Alright. Eternal happiness. This is it. What's gonna be inside? What's it gonna be? Uh oh. Nose, but there's only a nose. What? Yes, it's Benjamin. I stole it. Oh. I skipped the text. It Benjamin it took it. Happiness. I'm so upset. I knew the fox was I thought I could trust him. He stole your I thought the narrator was the, gonna be the bad guy. Oh, really just like, just hey, this child's gonna die today. Let's go on a what fun little game. We must find the fox. But Benjamin's the bad guy? I'm sure he hasn't gone far away. Let's go find him. Yes, Unless... let's do that. Oh, such a letdown. Unless Benjamin was doing it to protect us. Oh, I can sparkle. Sparkle. A box of rainbows and happiness. <gasps> Benjamin. <laughs> Benjamin? Did you steal Did he... any eternal happiness? Did you hear that entire oh, combo? Cool. Ooh. Okay. Come on, and there he goes. Give me back my happiness. Run what does that him. mean? We can't let what does that mean? Get away again. He stole your prize. Benjamin really disappointed me. I. What is the little swapping between? Because he built the safe circle, but. When I'm lost, yeah, children, she's got it. She's got. She's got. Search for what they have lost, or why they're in pain. Oh. Oh, is that supposed to be talking about us? Oh. It's giving us little more details. That's cool. Nah, you're imagining things. All right. So the first two to me didn't make sense. However, that one made sense. I think that one's referring. Maybe the narrator is the bad guy, and then the fox is the good guy, and then maybe he's. So maybe he's trying to keep me safe by taking my quote-unquote eternal happiness, which would ultimately result in my demise. Oh, shake out this stone. It's then, different from regular stones, I'm telling you. I think you're right. Can anyone read that? Oh, this piece is loose. I'll take it for me. Maybe it works somewhere else. Okay. Oh, I should probably put that back. <laughs> I should probably read that first. And then the game of death is what feeds the shadows of the beyond. Huh. What does this mean? That looks like nonsense to me, Miss Fortune. Huh, well, is it maybe Is it some, some nonsense? nonsense Maybe there is some more nonsense around. 
Let's go searching for some nonsense then. Let us go nonsense searching for some non nonsense. Ah, that, nope. that hole looks very much like where the fox would hide the prize. You mean the, I should go down there? the hole with the giant yes, fox sign on don't it? Worry. Nothing bad will happen. Nothing bad at all. Okay. I just <laughs> I'll trust you. Very trusting. Eh, eh. <laughs> this looks like a very dangerous hole. All right. I wonder why Benjamin will steal my prize. Maybe he's not happy himself. Maybe not. I guess maybe we should find out. I need that happiness myself and for mommy. Hello? Anybody down there? Oh, and she's falling. See, and that's what I was thinking would happen. And it did. Oh. Again, she didn't vomit. Oh, that was a pretty big fall. <laughs> I don't know why I expected it to be a larger hole. Alright then, I think that might be where I end it. Let's end it at this ominous hole. Let's just end it here. Let's... That's it. That, we'll find out what's at the end of this ominous hole next episode. Um, thank you for watching episode two of Little Misfortune. Um, if you did enjoy, please do consider leaving a like and subscribing. It's free, and you can always unsubscribe anytime. Also, turn on post notifications so that you get notified for part three of Little Misfortune. Thank you for watching. Have a good day. Have a good night. Have a good evening. And hope you have. Hopefully, you have a little less misfortune than Little Misfortune. Bye bye.